hello guys so today we gonna see and we are on tutorial number four so we gonna see uh, and learn about a zener diode so what is a zener diode and uh, what is the iv characteristics of it and we're gonna implement it on the lt spice platform so let's see uh, let's implement it and uh, I hope I suppose that you will be doing it in parallel with me So first of all, what is a Zener diode? This is a circuit of the sand Zener diode and this is the uh, IV characteristic that we need to obtain So what is a Zener diode? A Zener diode is a silicon semiconductor device that permits a current to flow in either forward or reverse direction so the diode consists of a specially heavily dropped PN junction and it is designed to conduct in the reverse direction when, uh, when a certain specified voltage is reached. So Zener diode has a well-defined re reverse breakdown voltage and uh, at which it, it starts conducting current and continues operating continuously in the reverse bias mode also without getting dam damage. Whereas the normal diode get damaged or it doesn't operate, uh, in, doesn't flow of the current doesn't occur when we uh, it is connected in a reverse bi uh, reverse bias mode. So the voltage drop across the diode remains constant over a wide range of the voltage, a feature that makes a Zener diode suitable for uses voltage regulation. So normally the diode in the forward, dia uh, forward bias mode has uh, turned uh, on voltages between uh, 0 0.3 to 0 0.7 voltage. And uh, it is uh, when connected in the reverse mode, uh, usually if there is a very small leakage current flow. Uh, as a reverse uh, voltage increase to the uh, predetermined voltage, uh, breakdown voltage, a current starts flowing through the diode. So the current increases to maximum which is determined by the series resistor after which it stabilizes and remains constant for the wide range when the voltage is applied. So this is all about uh, a short uh, intro that uh, what a Zener diode is. Now let's switch uh, and obtain this characteristic on the Altus Spice. So let's switch to the Altus Spice platform. So for understanding the introduction thing like uh, if you are uh, we have already covered three videos but if this is you you have come first uh, uh, video for uh, you are coming across through then you need to watch the previous three videos also and first is a very important video because it introduces you what is that is how, how to install it and what are the components available on it so as of now we are on Zener diode, so this is a new schematic plan uh, uh, available you can see on the screen. So here is the components we will go through. Let's take one by one component. So first component I am taking is voltage supply. Say OK. And escape to release from the component that is selected. So now you are very much familiar with that. We need one resistor. Okay. And to rotate it, we will do Control R. Then escape to release from the component. And we know we need one Zener diode. So it is here. Or either you can directly select. Uh, there are two methods. Either you can write a Zener over here and you will get directly the Zener diode. Or either when you write diode, show you if you write a diode and escape then when you uh, go to the cursor uh, over it move to the cursor over it and then right click and pick a new diode so when you go in this specification you can see your short key diodes are there you can see your uh, Zener diode is available whose name is BZX84C6V2L and uh, the breakdown voltage is also given that is a 6.2 voltage and uh, furthermore specification is given so as per your requirement of a specification these models you can select That's, these are the spice models available in the LT spice so now we need to one ground 
and the wire for the connectivity of this uh, making the circuit complete okay the next step so here we need to select the value of resistor and here we need to get the dc value let's say 10 let's say 20 okay uh, let's check once again our uh, this lt spice thing um, we need iv characteristics right so we need to do a dc sweep that means very varying the voltage from a certain value so we'll go to run and dc sweep and here what we will give we will give the name of the source we need to sweep and this is the linear type of sweep let's say starting value is 20 and the stop value is maximum 20 minus 20 to 20 and increment is 0 0.1 and ok let's check over here so your um, x axis is V and this probed indicates the selection of the current so this uh, is the curve uh, that this is the current across uh, zener diode we got so this is the origin axis and this is the exact graph we got so is it the exact graph or we need to do something so this uh, uh, graph is basically between uh, the supply voltage and the output current but we need to get over here is the diode voltage so for that let's um, define one node we, we need to label one node so for that you need to go over here and let's say I am writing it as X and placing it over here and escape and then rerun it Now place your cursor over here, right click and then you need to change it from V to VX and OK. So this is the desired curve we needed. So this is the curve of the Zener diode IV characteristics between the uh, voltage and current uh, for the zener diode so this is the um, your uh, current axis and this is your uh, voltage axis that is the voltage across zener diode and current across zener diode this is the axis this is the background of voltage if you want exact values then you need to uh, go over here and uh, uh, click when you click over here you will get one cursor and the cursor will give you one dialog box a box as such which will show the horizontal value and the vertical value so this is the cursor one uh, until now we haven't got any second graph so there is uh, not cursor two otherwise there can be many cursor so probably this is the breakdown voltage where we are like uh, yeah so now here you can check the vertical value means that uh, at this amount of uh, voltage the current is this much so minus 6.28 voltage and uh, for that we are getting the minus 2.886 milliampere of current and okay this much is the breakdown voltage we are getting minus 6.02 3 voltage and this much amount of um, current so if we switch it to the year so 
so it is somewhere okay so 3 341.85 or 297.79 millivolt of we cut off so as such you can uh, see and measure the exact value from the graph as well so this was the complete tutorial and practical implementation of the uh, diode on the LT spice uh, keep learning guys uh, do like if you like the video and learning part share with your friends and keep practicing uh, subscribe the channel thank you and stay safe happy Diwali guys thank you thank you so much